I'll keep going in a second. It's just uh, right now I only have. I honestly just want to see how it looked if I went live again. It's been a freaking minute, boys. It's been a freaking minute. Supposed to check. I was supposed to check something on my phone. No, I was supposed to check something. I was supposed to do something. Whatever tomorrow brings, I'll be there with open eyes and open arms. Yeah. So let's talk about some stuff, man. What are we gonna talk about, bro? Let's talk about life. Let's talk about racism. Let's talk about bitches. Start on getting some fucking money and stop fucking beating on your ass, bro. I watched a podcast today. It was very interesting to me. I wonder, can I have this shit capture like my PC or like stuff? Like, would it automatically capture this? No. Let me see if I could do that to where it can capture this. Says, this is not a vacation, I guess. I don't know. I'm just like I said. I'm just trying to get my PC back because I had to, had to delete shit, man. I'm gonna keep it above with y'all, gang. I'm gonna keep it 55th. You know me. I'm not one type of nigga to lie. Like I don't know. I don't have no games on here no more. I feel like. Oh, I see. I gotta download Steam again. I gotta install Steam. Steam was being a real headache. I even gonna cat to y'all too. That's the crazy part. No, she already got it. So I gotta just start it up. Steam set up. Like. No, see, I gotta just. Honestly, I probably just gotta go through and see what apps I still have and what apps I don't have. Mushroom, what time do we break? Okay, here it is. I was going to ask what we had to eat, mother. Huh? What do we have? Can we make some doodle? Okay. And I'll eat it with some rice and no beer. Where's iTunes?
updates. see if I could get it to like capture it says any full screen application but uh, I don't have nothing to test it besides like I said Google or something but when I put Google as a full screen it didn't do it you yeah, see it don't do it when I do Google We're gonna figure it out like I said and then we're gonna get back to it but nah I watched this interview with WAC 100 this guy named Hassan what's his name let me look it up yeah, so I don't so I don't get it wrong I don't want to misquote it it was WAC 100 no oh, wait hold on I gotta go to Spotify so yeah, if you don't got Spotify, you're going to have to wait till they put it on YouTube. But I don't think they're going to put it on YouTube. I think he only just going to have it like this. But yeah, I was watching this. You see, you see how far I got into it. I was really watching it. Let me just play a little bit. I do not own the sound to this. So academics, do not sue me. Drunk, I was like, yo, bro, damn, I don't feel like driving a house. Salute, oh, salute to the people. Somehow they peeled you out of bed because yeah, you nah, were so not. But anyway, let, let, let me not just... Oh, play this whole shit out when I met you you seen how I pulled up I pulled up with all my jewelry I pulled up with so basically you feel me you see is Danny aka snitch nine uh his people's academics uh who else is it featuring it's uh okay so yeah it's snitch nine whack 100 and Hassan Campbell so apparently let me look up Hassan Campbell I mean, I got a freaking computer right here. We're gonna look this nigga up right here. So, Hassan Campbell. I mean, uh, this obviously doesn't happen. We're gonna have this, this gonna be a little podcast. So, this nigga, how many Hassan Campbell YouTube? Damn. This nigga, so Hassan Campbell, he has. 386 subscribers. So in the interview, you know, he was basically saying like, oh, like Snitch Nine, like, you was cool and all, so you did like your snitch and everything like that. And Six Nine was like, oh, like basically like, if you was in my position, what would you do? And I said, I feel like I said to this crowd, I feel like he said some real shit. I just feel like, my thing is, bro, or my thing is as like understanding that streets is, like they always say, there's street rules, there's street politics, there's selective politics, and there's no rules. Like, I just feel like it's more so like a thing that's like understood, but not really stated. Like, you're not gonna see no freaking. You know how there's a bill of rights. You know, yeah, like there's a bill of freaking rights. You're not gonna see a freaking. I don't know. I don't know what it's talking about. It says something about select the folder, got the grand theft auto. What do you mean? Oh. Dang, I do not remember my Steam account stuff right now. So we're gonna sign into that later. So yeah, so I feel like it's not like no Bill of Rights, ain't no Ten Commandments. It's nothing that's gonna be set in stone. It's just stuff that's understood. That's like, you know, I'm not gonna lie. You gonna have some rules that you have with your homies, that's understood across the board. But then when you get it around certain people, you might not let it slide. Like you might let your homie, you might with your homie, you might be like, hey, bro, 
you know what I'm saying? My, that my nigga might cheat or something, you feel me? But you be over here saying, nah, don't cheat and it's not good. Cheating is not good. But with your homie, you, you said it's okay to cheat. You not saying you're okay, but you let that nigga slide. It's like, it's kind of like that. It's like, you know, some of the shit is kind of iffy, but you just know it as it's understood as like, respect is respect. What's right is right. What's wrong is wrong. But it's like, niggas know what to do and niggas know what they can get away with. You know what you can do. You know what you can say to a man that's like, okay, psh, okay, it's all, it's finna pop off. You know what you can do to a man that's like, psh, okay, now I know this guy obviously knows it's a threat. If you come at a nigga uh, walking, you know what I mean? Like with the whole Chris Rock and freaking Will Smith shit. Like when that nigga's walking up on him. In the streets? Bro, I'm sure this nigga Chris Rock is not letting niggas walk up to him and slap him. Period, point blank, period. But this nigga's at the, at the what is it, Oscars? The nigga's laying his guard down. What do you expect? The nigga's on, bro. I was like, I didn't let Will Smith walk up on me. I'd probably be like, bro, you probably finna come and talk. You finna come and take a joke. You finna, you finna, you finna you probably finna come and roast me. My bad. My bad. G.I. Jane. Okay, you finna come in. You finna come and tell me, hey, hey, y'all, just so you know, my wife has alopecia. So this is why she's bald. I'm thinking he's finna come in and lie in the audience. Nigga, come smack bro in the face. That is not cool. You can't do that. You can't do that. Just like with 6 9 You can't. I don't care. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to kidnap you. I'm so sorry to fuck your baby mama. But you cannot be the front runner. You cannot be Trey Way. Trey Way. You cannot be niggas if he uh niggas got the blicky uh you can't do that. And then when it's time to go to court, say that you don't fuck with these niggas. Cause you was fucking with them. You was their culture. You was them, you was six nine. Like whacking them sending the this interview. Nigga, a nigga like since I should never been in it. Period. That's why when he be trying to ask people like, "What would you do in my situation?" I wouldn't be in your situation. I would have never. I would have never did that. I would have never moved like that. I would have never been stupid enough to do that. So if you ask me what I would do in your situation, I just wouldn't be in that situation. Period. So that's why it's, it's different. We just built different six nine. I understand you might have your own little upbringing. You might think that you smarter than these niggas. That you like, nah, I did that shit for myself. I'm sorry, bro. And I don't. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. What these other rapper niggas be on? But I know me. I'm not going to go at a nigga. If I'm going to see him, I'm not going to keep that same energy. I be trying to tell niggas, bro. Niggas be trying to do too much shit for the internet. Niggas be trying to do too much shit for the internet. You got to understand, bro. There's an image people try to portray. And there's a real image there is. People seem to get it mixed confused because, you know, they feel like comments, people, what people think on the internet, comment section, all that stuff, this matters. It doesn't matter, bro. Most of the shit that niggas be saying on the internet, they only gonna sit on the internet. Most niggas I be like, bro, this person's fat, this person's ugly. Bro, let a nigga see you in his face, bro. He's not saying that to you, bro. He, even if he feel that way, he's not saying that. Unless he just like that, you feel me? He just, you know, he's just bold enough to just tell any nigga to his face, like, hey, bro, you ugly. Hey, bro, you this, you that. Most of these niggas is only like that on the internet. So once you let that into your head, bro, you're done. You see me now, bro. I'm on a freaking live stream. The fucking live stream says start a game in the fucking background. I don't have no fucking game. I'm talking to you guys. But you guys see how I'm doing this shit? And then when it's like 20 fucking people, then I'm going to just transfer that shit. And then I'm going to, you know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to say too much though. But that one viewer, hey, bro, I appreciate you. Who, who are you? How do I have? Yes, sir. Appreciate you not a Mr. Beast contest, you know? It's just, you know, people people just don't, people don't understand, you know? But that's that's what I'm here to do. I'm here to educate. That's what, like, my podcast, like I said, is going to be. It's going to be called the Player Chat because it's going to be player stuff, player things, to be by player guy. But, like I said, this was just a test just to see how my shit is doing. Once I get it all shut up, I'm going to start playing my games again. As you guys can see on my uh, on my uh, Twitch page, I said I want to try to be Amy for Wednesdays to do try to do a stream at 12 p.m. Yeah, if it's not 12 in the afternoon, it's gonna be a certain time that day. Whatever time that day, that's what we're gonna try to do. So, like I said, we're gonna try to aim for Wednesdays. I appreciate you, not Mr. Beast contest watching. You feel me? Hey, like I said, tune in. And you know what? I might I might even stay and talk. I just it's just because I'm fasting right now. It's Ramadan. So I need to eat. You feel me? I don't want to. I don't want like that. I don't want to leave you here. Okay, well, my freaking stream is drop frame. So let me just end it. Appreciate you guys, man. K-Sex out.